What is up, everybody? This is Ad Rob, and welcome back to Pokemon Fire Red version. In the last episode, we took on the Grass Gym in Celadon City. Now we are here in Saffron City, where we also just beat the Fighting Dojo and got Hitmonlee. Uh, put him in the PC, but still got him. Um, now we are actually all stocked up. I stocked up on supplies off camera. Sorry. Um, we got 10 Hyper Potions, 10 Full Heals, and 3 Revives. We are good to go for Sylph Company. Now, there is a way to rush straight to the top, but we're not going to do that because we need to do a little bit of training uh, before actually battling the boss along with my rival. So, um, the, one of the nice things actually about this is that you can actually run inside this building, which is really cool. I believe you can use the elevator anytime in this one. You don't need the lift key, but you do need um, the key to open some doors. So we're actually going to we're gonna do a little bit of training. We're actually close to an evolution here, which is really cool. <coughs> awesome, we got a flying type to fight. Hopefully that'll finish off in one more attack. And wing attack may be the first good move Golbat has. I don't even know if he learns it naturally, to be honest. That's obnoxious, he got another attack in. Nice. Level up already. not change Pokemon. Since I have another gold battle, I'll probably switch to Mimian, just because I don't want Charlie taking too much damage right off the bat here. Awesome. I'll keep one shying these Zubats. shots in a row. Not getting much XP though. This will do though. This will do nicely. Could just switch to Keith, but also do this. Just as easily. We got a quick attack in. Oh. Well, that sucks. Kick his ass, Keith. Get out of here. Your nonsense. I goofed. Yeah, you goofed. But what? Charlie is evolving, even though he's unconscious. All right. I actually had no idea that he evolved this early, but I was I actually went to train off camera um, to make it a little easier. Um, and then suddenly this happened, so I was like, "All right, well, we got to go back and uh, evolve on camera because that's not that's not gonna do." So Charlie is now a Dragonair, which is awesome. Let's take a look at his stats. <clears throat> uh, Alright, so we got an overall buff rather than one specific area that he's really good in, which is what we want. Maybe overkill to give him this stuff, but it's whatever. Yeah, I'll, f I'll fight you. I'll fight you. No kids allowed. 
I think what, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna fight like the first two floors or something, and then I'm gonna go for uh, go for uh, rival fight. First, first act as a uh, Dragonair is a miss. Rage. Oh man. Ah, oh, come on. Took four slams. Oh, come on! That's so frustrating! Twice in a row. And now he's confused. I don't believe that shed skin covers confusion either. But he snapped out, which is good. Now he's gonna obliterate the Zubat. Thing over here. It was just a teleport pad. Probably just a teleport pad. Magnemite. First we're seeing a U. Magnemite's a pretty cool Pokemon. Oh crap! It's it's steel in this game, isn't it? Is it? We're gonna find out. I want to see. All right, well, it missed anyways. Let's uh not do that. Mimian should not be affected by a supersonic. Yes, soundproof. Get wrecked, son. It's not effective. Really? Wait, but Sonic Boom isn't sound based. Grass effective against uh, that? No? Alright, well, I'm just swinging and missing here, aren't I? I honestly don't understand how Supersonic is not a sound based move. Uh, we'll just we'll just take him on as Mimian. Oh, cause he's steel crap. You're just gonna paralyze him. That's fine. We'll do we'll do this. I think fighting super effective against steel? It is. Okay, great. Great. <clears throat> I got a type advantage right for once. You're good. I know. Okay. We're not going to give one to Charlie because he has his ability. But we are going to heal him up. Yep, it's just a teleport pad in there, and we have cleared out the first level. I 
anything over here? Just a teleport pad. Huh. Quit messing with us, kid! How about quit being bad all the time? Huh. Let's get Keith out here. Oh, that's cute. That's real cute. You think you're gonna get an attack in? Well, I'm sorry to say, but uh, you're wrong. Actually, not so sorry to say. Kind of happy to say. Alright, let's use Thunder Wave. Hopefully it'll shake off our paralysis. Yes, awesome. That is perfect, but I missed. That's okay, because he's paralyzed. And we miss again, which is not very okay. But is a little more okay, because he's paralyzed. There we go. <clears throat> I feel like that's just how it's going to be. We're just going to have random spurts of missing, like, multiple times in a row. But that's all right. There's one level. I won't change Pokemon, but I will change Pokemon. Because that's... that makes sense. <clears throat> there we go. Wonderful. Let's see, let me check how far Gary is along with his XP. Not far at all. I was thinking I want a Blastoise before the rival fight, but I don't think that's going to happen. I think just having Charlie like 32 is a reasonable goal. What am I to do? Stay put, buddy. <clears throat> oh, no one else here. Alright. To the next floor. There we go. There's someone. Fighting type rocket. Interesting. It identified me. I don't know if I don't know if I like that. That was a crit? Hello? I'm trying to fight people and get experience, but can't find them anywhere. Hello. 
<laughs> I like how I like tapped him on the shoulder. I was like, hello? He goes, ah, intruder spotted! Yeah, wah, 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 Should be able to handle the Zubat himself. Even though Mimian could definitely one shot it. Nice. And Cubone will be Gary's responsibility. Oh, Gary! Hit him with a quick water pulse. Boom. And what do we have here? I think that's it for this floor that I can access right now. I'm just clearing floors here. I think I'm actually just gonna naturally stumble upon the way in. Cause I mean I'm already I'm already on the floor I need to be on to get the key and all that. Nice crit. Did we get a flinch? We did not get a flinch. That's alright. Ooh, crit right back though. That'll end it. Nice chunk of XP. That's gonna be a hyper potion on Geary. How far are we on Charlie, XP wise? Pretty far. Might get him to 32. Just doing what we're doing now. Uh, we'll fight this nice man. He has four Pokemon, so we'll probably just fight him and then go to the rival fight. back and forth until Charlie is level 32, which should just be one more Pokemon, hopefully. Not quite enough. We'll change Pokemon. Probably handle this one himself, but I'll give it to Minion.
Side beam should finish him off. Awesome. That's good for Charlie. I'm not going to change, just going to finish off this battle. And there we go. Apply items and we'll head to the rival fight. That's unfortunate. He only has one, we're fine. That is lunch meat for Mimian. Nice. Beautiful one shot. And we're good to go. That's the card key that's going to help us open the doors. So let's do just that on the third floor. And we effectively skip floors 6 through 11, basically. I fought you, right? Yeah. Bingo! So let's see, my Pokemon are all set. Charlie's first to fight Pidgeot. Pidgeot? Yeah. Hey, what's up, buddy? Alright. Came to see if I got better. Well, I've always been better than you, buddy. But, uh, if you want me to prove it again, I'll be more than happy. Ah, that's what I didn't do. That's alright. I was gonna give an elixir to my Pokemon. It turns out that's not that, that needed. It looks like I'm gonna need to throw out a Thunder Wave here. Hoping for bigger damage. Aw, oh, man. That's unfortunate. Let's use Gary. I would use Keith, but obviously, type disadvantage. At least you got that paralyze in. Trying to get the confusion in too, so he's double double locked. No such luck. Man, he only dealt with paralysis once. It's obnoxious. Thank you. I will change Pokemon. Mimian's a beast. Okay. Here's the poker flute. Now that's a catchy tune. Wait, what? Wait, what? 
This is just. Does it just not work sometimes? Or is it because it's Mimian's ability? Well. Okay. Sure, just eat some free damage then, I suppose. Thank you. Game, the game uh, evened it out. Oh man, that XP. Trick? I, I don't think so. Well, let's take a look. Trading held items. No, I'm, I'm all set. Huh. Well, Mimian's work is done, so I'm not going to switch. I'm going to take a minute to revive Charlie instead. me. Tricky, tricky. This is a hyper potion. Awesome. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. That's double weakness. That will kill in three attacks. Very nice. It's a lot of XP. Not change, come and get that nice paralysis in before switching out. And I'm gonna get that last hyper potion on to Gary, hopefully. Actually, I have two left. Alright, good, good. hurt himself? I guess not. Okay. I she's she just kept going with uh with Charlie there until I until he was knocked out. So that Gary didn't take any free damage, but that's alright. Ah oh, man. Now I can yeah, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna throw some paralysis onto Alakazam. Assuming he's fast enough. Which he's not, but Alakazam didn't knock out Charlie, so. That's alright. Yep. And get countered! Woo! Aha! Yo, Charlie might be able to just take him out himself. Yo, critical! Way to go, Charlie. Awesome. Alright, there we go. So, you are ready for the boss rocket. Well, thanks to you, maybe not now. Smell ya. Alright. And this guy is going to give you a Pokemon that you can't get anywhere else. You get a Lapras. <laughs> we keep it in our lab. But it's much better off with you. As I go to place it in a computer. 
So before we take on Giovanni, we're going to go to the Pokemon Center, regroup a little bit, and then we'll come back stronger than ever. I would like you to do that. And Lapras will head to the PC. It's nice seeing you, Lapras. Astoria. I wish they they g didn't give you Pokemon that are so under leveled by this point in the game, you know. Like both Hit Hitmonlee and Lapras are super cool Pokemon that I would love to use, but by the time you get them. You know, you need Pokemon that are 35 and above, and you're getting them at level 25, so... Kinda useless, you know? And who's first? Yeah, Charlie's good. Charlie's good to go. He's finished off two big fights for us in the last two episodes. I know we're running a little over time, but I think that's alright. I just want to clear this tower. Nice little crit. Bone Meringue? Was that- did I read that correctly? He's using Bone Meringue? Alright, well I guess that's a thing. Maybe we'll get Blastoise by the end of the episode. That'd be pretty hype. Finish this. And there goes Drowsy. Okay. I believe we have one more grunt before we can fight Giovanni. Let me just switch Gary out to the front. Oh, no. there he is. Alright, so, immediate boss fight. I believe he's holding the Master Ball right there. Interesting. Ah, oh, I should have had Minion first. Is he ground type yet? I don't think he's ground type. I think he's only ground type once he evolves. Which is unfortunate. Oh, I thought it was going to be a really slow one shot. I was really excited. Day. 41. Jeez. Oh. And you use a fighting type move. Wow. What a choice. It's 
poison. So is that gonna kill? It is not. Ah! You can't beat a Pokemon five levels under you. Oh man. Hello. We'll switch. Really, you're not gonna. <laughs> why? Why am I questioning the choices CPUs make at this point in the game? We all know they make dumb decisions. You should have just knocked out Keith. At the perfect opportunity. Cross chop. Ooh, ooh. Let's take a look. It is fighting. Get rid of Brick Break. I just gave him Brick Break, but... Oh man, one-shot potential is there. Or Rage. Rage is bad, apparently. Yeah. <laughs> Get rid of Rage. Yeah, the one-shot one potential there is pretty crazy. Slow one shot. Very nice. Alright, four grand for winning. Boss fights are profitable, I'll tell you that much. Let's talk to this guy right here. Oh dear boy, thank you for saving Sylph. I'm not gonna read all that. But I am rich, I will give you something. So we get the Master Ball! So you only get one of these the entire game, and uh, basically it's instant catch on any Pokemon. So of course the one ev everyone thinks, or not everyone at this point, but initially the thought is, oh I'll use it to catch my favorite legendary Pokemon. The truth is, you can catch Mewtwo and all the legendary birds with Ultra Balls. You just need to be really patient about it. That Master Ball should go to whichever dog Pokemon you get. Anyways, we are way over time here, almost at 40 minutes, but we cleared the entire Sylph Co. in one episode. I'm really happy about that. Um, in the next episode, we're going to be heading south towards uh, Fuchsia City and the Poison-type gym. Um, actually, just kidding, we're going to take on the Psychic-type gym here in Saffron City. I forgot we still haven't done that. So, that's going to be our main uh, agenda Point next episode. So I will see you guys then.